Hi guys, welcome now to the Quest for the Open vlog this week. And I'm not waiting till after the Open. <laughs> I'm starting it now, out here at Dunham with myself, obviously. Uh, we've got Andy and we've got Rick as well. This is 2018 now. Oh, and by the way, happy birthday, Rick. This is now Monday, so you'll be watching this on Thursday. But into the comments. I don't know why I'm using my sing-song cheeky to a child voice. But say happy birthday. <laughs> I don't have any kids, but I imagine that's how parents speak to the kids. <laughs> so we're out here, I don't know, we're doing uh, a, well, a second part of open qualifying. We're carrying it on to see who can uh, win overall out of us three. Oh, what an awesome day that was yesterday. Um, played some very, very erratic golf. <laughs> yeah, it was all over the place to begin with, but managed to play some decent golf in the end and actually it turned into a really good round. So those videos will be dropping, I think from today, which is Tuesday. I think my vids are coming at the weekend. It's well worth watching to the end as well, for my sake. <laughs> and I was gonna have a little bit of a stop of these Quest for the Open vlogs. I was gonna wait till after the Open, but you know, there's no time like the present to get going. There really, really isn't. And I was considering just having a little bit of a break, but I don't want to. I really don't want to, I just want to plough on, I want to carry on and I want to keep hitting it hard. So I'm going to be doing a lot of play this week, a lot of practice this week, refocusing on the battle ball, just introducing a few new things to you guys as well and then seeing where this week takes us. Lots of exciting plans leading up to the Open as well, which I should be able to share with you. Right, I've got to go out for a couple of meetings and I'm meeting Rick and then going to play Nutsford, which is a little nine hole uh, down by Mir, which I've not played before, but it's meant to be lovely. So I got out to Nutsford Golf Club and that is Town Park which is just over the uh, the fence there. There's deer, there's apparently deer on this course which Rick says is a hidden gem. I've played it a number of times and I've always really enjoyed it. It's like one of those courses that you literally don't know about. <laughs> I think that the members like it that way. No, I didn't. Sorry if we're giving any exposure to the golf course today. Yeah, did he, they, I think they want to keep it secret to be honest. So we've got me, got Rick and we've also got Matt Fryer who is just getting some water, I hope. I'm rather thirsty. And by the way, I've just had a sandwich and some chips for £3.50 in the clubhouse. So it'd be cheaper coming, it'd be cheaper driving here <laughs> by having lunch every day. Just making that a one big meal, because it's still meal. And like doing that for the rest of the year? How much would that cost me in food? Calculate it in a year. It's a fair point. Right guys, I had such a good time uh, this morning that I'm going to have a bit of an evening round as well and I'm going to do a scramble test. So for nine holes, the new target is to try and get around the level par and then I'm also going to try and do the 50 yard pitching test as well. Remember I need to try and get five on this. So I'm going to try and do a few things out here. Um, I'll try and film as much as possible and then do the scores, uh, but we'll see how we get on. Right, love it here, beautiful little course. a new shot then didn't work the only problem I'm having and the thing I need to change about the scramble test is I've hit a pitch there 71 yards so 
it would require me to drop off the green if I hit it. And it's just gone onto the fringe. So I'm going to be putting my net where I'm going to have to introduce a new rule, but I'll think about that. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubts disappointed about the test so missed out on the scramble test by two in the end I think but didn't take advantage of the short par fours and the par five and then on that last hole after I didn't hold that chip I was well, I should have taken more time but fails a fail anyway so two over and then on the uh, 50 yard pitching test missed out by one had a really good start and then just didn't quite get another one in <sighs> oh well improvements Certainly within the 50 yard pitching, getting closer, a couple more putts and yeah, would have been all right, but time to get home and have a bit of a break, have a bit of a, a, bit of a chill. Bought a house today. Yeah, these Dunham Forest videos edited, they will be up by Saturday, I think. Wrapped it around there in 62 in the Lynx PGA event in 2012. Well, I think she was about to do that as well. Hi. <laughs> another day, another golf course, and another video being filmed. We're this time with Andy Carter. Always. Again. How many videos have we filmed together this week? Two. Get away from you. That's not enough, that. Oof, I don't know. I think after today it might be enough for me for a while. <laughs> We're playing here at Pike Fold, and this has been literally the... Oh, no, nothing to do with you. Well, a little bit to do with you. Massive topsy-turvy match. Ridiculous match. I'll fire up some clips, but... These, these geese, they're doing what I want to do, it's running away. So some decent progress made, some decent progress made. Been focusing mainly on those two this week, but as you can see, as you can see, we've got lots to do. It's been a crazy, crazy week so far. I've played a lot of golf, done a lot of practice, filmed a lot of videos, and also got a new house. 
which is exciting. So we've managed to find a buyer for our current house um, and then we're going to be moving into another one as well later on this year. So it's all been, it's all been a bit mental really. <laughs> Today's plan is basically edit and then get Finch Friday filmed. So it's going to be just a work at home day. It's a bit of a shame really because the weather's beautiful outside although it is meant to be thunderstorming later on. But I've had this down all week as my must do work day. So I must stay strong, I must not break <laughs> and I must get it done. Back in coaching Friday, Saturday as well, which I'm really, really looking forward to. It's always nice when it comes around to the weekend and I get to go coach again. It's, yeah, it's a nice feeling. Right guys, thank you so, so much for watching. Loads, loads, loads coming up over the next few weeks in the run to the open. So many exciting things planned. You are really not going to want to miss out on some of the stuff we've got going on. So make sure you subscribe to both myself and Rick because boy, oh. Alright guys, thanks for watching, make sure you subscribe, follow me on my other social media platforms as well, all linked in the description below, and we'll see you next time. Okay, let's go edit.